This video explains the topic projection of lines in the subject engineering graphics. Line is the shortest distance between two points. Different position of line with respect to horizontal and vertical planes are line parallel to HP and perpendicular to VP, line parallel to VP and perpendicular to HP, line parallel to both HP and VP, line parallel to VP and inclined to HP, line parallel to HP and inclined to VP, line inclined to both HP and VP. True length of a line. It is actual length of a line. When a line is parallel to VP, its elevation has true length. When a line is parallel to HP, its plan has true length. True inclination of a line. It is actual inclination of a line to a plane. When a line is inclined to HP and parallel to VP, its elevation shows the true inclination. When a line is inclined to VP and parallel to HP, its plan shows the true inclination. Now, we will discuss different position of a line in detail. Line parallel to HP and perpendicular to VP. When a line is parallel to HP, we will have the true length of the line in the plan. Here the line is perpendicular to VP and hence the line can be seen as a point in the elevation. Consider a problem. A line AB 70 mm long has its end A 50 mm above HP and 15 mm in front of VP. Further, the line is parallel to HP and perpendicular to VP. First, draw an XY line. The line AB is parallel to HP. Its true length can be seen in the plan. Before drawing the line, its end point A can be fixed first. End A is 15 mm in front of VP. So the plan of point A can be fixed 15 mm below the XY line. The line is perpendicular to VP. Draw a line from A perpendicular to the XY line. This is true length of the line that is 70 millimeters. The other end point of the line is B. Since the line is perpendicular to VP, the line can be seen as a point in the elevation and this point is 50 mm above XY line because end point A of the line is 50 mm above the HP. This point is A dash and B dash. In the next case, line parallel to VP and perpendicular to HP. Whenever a line is parallel to VP, we will have its true length in the elevation. Line is perpendicular to HP, so the line can be seen as a point in the plan. Here is a problem. A line AB, 70 mm long, has its end A, 20 mm above HP and 30 mm in front of VP. The line is further perpendicular to HP and parallel to VP. Draw an XY line first. End A is 20 mm above HP, so mark a point 20 mm above the XY line, it is A dash. Since the line is parallel to VP, elevation has true length. The line is further perpendicular to HP, so the line and the elevation should be perpendicular to XY line. The other end of the line is B dash. Plan of the line is a point which is 30 mm in front of XY line. Name it as A comma B. In the next case, line parallel to both HP and VP. Since the line is parallel to both the planes, both the elevation and plan have true length. Elevation and plan are going to be lines parallel to XY line. Let us take a problem. A line 70 mm long has its end A 25 mm above HP and 30 mm in front of VP and the line is parallel to both HP and VP. Draw an XY line, fix a point A 25 mm above the XY line, this is A dash, through A dash, draw a line parallel to XY line for a length of 70 mm. The other end of the line in the elevation is B dash. Draw projectors from A dash and fix the end point of plan 30 mm from the XY line. 
this is a draw projector from b dash now draw horizontal line through a up to the projector drawn from b dash this intersection point is b the next case is line inclined hp and parallel to vp since the line is parallel to vp elevation will have true length line is inclined hp this inclination also can be seen in the elevation take a problem a line ab 70 mm long has its end a 25 mm above hp and 30 mm in front of vp line is 30 degrees inclined to hp and parallel to vp after drawing xy line draw projections of end point a of the line point a is 25 mm above hp so elevation of the point is 25 mm above xy line it is a dash from a dash draw a 30 degree line length of this line is the true length that is 70 mm the other end point of the line is b dash draw projector from a dash and mark plan of the point a 30 mm below the xy line draw projectors from b dash also now draw a horizontal line from a up to the projector drawn from b dash this is b since the line is parallel to vp plan ab is parallel to xy line the next case is line parallel to hp and inclined to vp line is inclined to vp this inclination can be seen in the plan line is parallel to hp so the elevation is a line parallel to xy line let us take a problem a line ab 70 mm long has its end a 40 mm above hp and 25 mm in front of vp the line is 45 degrees inclined to vp and parallel to hp draw the xy line first mark a 25 mm below the xy line because end a is 25 mm in front of vp line is 45 degrees inclined to vp draw a 45 degree line from a for a distance of 70 mm which is the true length the other end point is b now fix a dash 40 mm above the xy line draw projector from b draw a horizontal line from a dash up to the projector this point is b dash the next case is line inclined to both the planes that is both horizontal plane and vertical plane this case will be explained in detail with the, with some examples in our next videos